Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Kabir Considers. In this video I'm going to react to police spike strip failures and successes. Now this is going to be a fun one because spike strips, I mean because the police officer has to manually roll out the strip in anticipation of the car, you know, it's there's, there's so many variables like what if the car doesn't take that route what if the car sees them coming and swerves in another direction you know so I, I imagine the success rate for this is probably around 50 50 maybe 60 40 so yeah this video here I'm sure it's going to be really interesting to watch just to see you know like see the successes where the tires get shredded versus the failures when the you know it's just done for no reason so let's do it when it comes to stopping high speed car chases the police have a lot of tools to aid them but perhaps the safest and most effective is the spike trap it does however require some technique and coordination oh! and sometimes doesn't quite go as well as Man. it should brilliant news Ooh. Oh man! Because yeah, once you've deployed it and it's you've you've you know got the guy you're after, you've then got to get it back. Who are they after? A lot of cars. Four or five cars. Is this the UK? This looks like it's the UK. The UK or somewhere in Europe. Okay, that's the guy coming around the corner. Oh, got him. They got His him. timing was perfect. Spiked the guy and got the trap out of the Perfect. Way. Gosh. Deputies got spike strips out. High speed chase, baby. Here we go. Watch this. Is it true that spike strips are, are only meant to be used if the car's traveling 35 miles an hour or below? Because he looked like he was going quicker than 35. But then again, you know, you, you gotta do what you gotta do. Damn, he ain't getting out of that one. Nah, he's, he's, he's going nowhere. I didn't believe they had any weapons. Holy shit. Tag, I believe. They're passing illegal head on into traffic. No traffic at the moment. Come up on y'all. He's got the spike trap, but it's going to be hard to cover both lanes. Oh, he dodged it. Oh, no. Oh, no. That was, to be honest, that was impossible because the the police car was so close to the uh, the perpetrator, so he would have got the police car would have got spiked as well. Man, being a police officer, like, I imagine a lot of these guys have, like, high blood pressure, you know. Your heart is constantly beating fast because you're involved in these these chases. So this is the guy that they're after, this guy in the silver, the silver vehicle. He's going pretty quick. That guy, he's got to be doing at least 100. He's doing 100 miles yeah. per hour now. Dude, 115. All right, he's closing in on him. 
Is he gonna? There's no way he's not gonna pit Looks maneuver like him. He's going to have to do it the old fashioned. What is he gonna pit maneuver him at 115? No way. Hundred and twenty two miles an hour. Yeah, there's no way. Because if he pit maneuvered him, he's going to die. He's not going to make it. No way. Doing a PIT maneuver at 130 miles per hour takes nerves of steel. <laughs> He pitted him. God, if anybody knows how this one, how that one ended, please tell me, please. I need to know. Instantly, that tire. Did you see the front, the front left tire? Instantly torn to pieces. Torn to pieces. What are the, are the spikes made out of? They must be made out of like steel or something. When setting a spike trap, in addition to quick reflexes, you need good intel. Oh, oh God, did they... Th I think the police car got spiked. Oh, man. Yeah, the police car got spiked, I think. Or didn't they? I thought the police car got spiked with how quickly it, it broke, how quickly the it decelerated. Definitely got spiked. You can hear the, the air escaping the tire. Oh dear. Ooh, he threw that badly. Oh man, he didn't get Has enough. Has he got time to throw it again? No, he doesn't. He doesn't. Does he? Ooh, just oh, just his rear tire. Man, oh man. My gosh. They've got him. They've got the perk. Have you ever seen a spike trap in action? Look at this Let one. In the Bam! <laughs> really entertaining. Really interesting to watch. I mean... I think at some point there's going to be another thing developed, maybe an, uh, an easier way to de deploy these strips, maybe some kind of uh, something that maybe you place on the floor and it pushes the strip out by itself, because I don't think, you know, manually tossing the strip, the, it, it really depends on the accuracy of the officer who's throwing it. So yeah, I reckon we're going to see innovations real soon, but man, this was a fun watch. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one.